Robin Williams' first appearance on the, um, on the Tonight Show. Um, he doesn't do many outside appearances. I think I saw him about three years ago. I think he was on uh, with Dick Cabot one night. Did you know he's the star, uh, star of the very successful Mork and Mindy show, which is uh, beginning its uh, fourth season on the air. I begin this Thursday. And he's going to have seen a new film late next spring called The World According to Garth. Did you ever read that book? I read that book. Interesting, yes. funny book. Would you welcome Robin Williams? Jesus. And Sears had a sale, this furniture went cheap. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm okay now. I'm out here. Mama, I'm on TV. <laughs> For my friends in San Francisco, how old? Nine, 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 oh. That should wake him up. That's a lead back place up there. Oh, God. You were right. Last time I saw you, you were with Cabot about three years ago. Yes, sir, and that's why I haven't done anything since. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm a little scared. I was standing backstage about to go on and everything. All of a sudden, my whole body went, everybody out! <laughs> we have two exits. Any way you want to leave, everybody out! All of a sudden, I said, dear Lord, make my cheeks of ice. <laughs> so that's why I walked out a little bit like, good evening, nice to be on the show. <laughs> I said, oh, no, the pants fit now. OK. People always think performers don't get nervous. Not at all, really. I don't. Oh, God. <laughs> not really. Not at all. Not really. Not me. No way. Is there some reason you don't do Is it the fact that you get nervous? Do you Very much many so. Shows? I, I suffer from severe dyslexia, too. Oh. I was the only child in my block in Halloween to go trick or trout. <laughs> <laughs> here, go, oh, look, here comes that young Williams boy again. <laughs> Better get some fish. <laughs> here you go. Say hi to your mom and dad. <laughs> Where'd they find you? <laughs> oh. where, where is home for you? Or did you come from a home? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> People, the institution, Tommy. <laughs> if you haven't taken your medication yet, it's gonna be fine. <laughs> They're back at 12. Back at 12, yeah. No. How are you, Mr. Williams? I'm real fine. I'm... <laughs> Look at this thing. Look, Flipper. <laughs> <laughs> right now, there's a sound man going, What are you doing? Oh, God. I better We're... relax, relax, relax. It's okay. I'm on it's TV. Right. Just... You're a nice man. You won't hurt me. No, no. No, no. <laughs> Oh, no, let me just one sip. One sip. Okay, thank you. Don't be afraid. It's not, I, the sores went away. <laughs> the simplex two is yeah. it? One. One or a two. real man can stand up to herpes. <laughs>
Look, look, little Ronald Reagan pencils here. Yes, they have no point. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Williams. We're time to audit you and your firstborn again. <laughs> Nancy and I are... You know, I've noticed a very strange thing about him, yeah. though. That he never speaks while Nancy's drinking water. Do you notice that? <laughs> She's dubbing him. Would be. Yes. Would be. And her Would lips be. never... <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> that should get me audited again. Yeah. You speaking your firstborn, you have no children. No, sir. Not that I know of. <laughs> <laughs> None have gone, are you Mr. Williams? Yes. <laughs> You're my daddy. <laughs> See, by present account, eight million dollars. <laughs> Somebody told me you went to a serious acting school. Yeah, what was Juilliard? That? Juilliard. Hmm. Wait, right now there's some guy going, What instrument did you play? <laughs> Say the organ. I said, No, what? You wanted to be a serious? Serious actor. Serious Shakespeare. Actor. I was there when John Hausman was the headmaster. I remember him saying one day, Mr. Williams, the theater needs you. I'm going off to sell Volvos. <laughs> Did you ever appear in Shakespeare? Yes, sir, I did. I, I remember I was just coming from California. They, they had the Shakespearean auditions. I was going, to be or not to be, wow, for sure, totally. <laughs> so, I'm sorry, next. Thank you. So we did plays. We did Romeo and Juliet. Do you remember the whole soliloquy of to be or not to be? No, not to be like, to be a whole line. Um, You're not to be. <laughs> well, it is noble as the slings and arrows of needle is with needle. No, wrong. Outrageous one. fortune. Outrageous fortune. Or to take arms against friends. See, a sea of troubles. And by wow, this is great that you know all this. Yeah. <laughs> and by opposing, end them. But yet a man who will know himself, but yet not touch himself. <laughs> what, what, what is that from? Is that Midsummer from, Night's Dream yeah, or what? That's from the self-abuse soliloquy. <laughs> we were talking during the break that who was uh, going to join as part-time on the show or full-time? Full-time. Johnny Winters? Oh, yes, the king. Yeah, he's uh, you're obviously a fan of his. Oh, like yes, I am. he's wonderful. God. Yeah. Uncle John, if you're watching, take care. <laughs> Don't let him bounce you around the rubber rooms anymore. <laughs> hey, Gray Bear, I'm here with the Silver Fox. <laughs> Gray Bear, Gray Bear, I'm home now. Billy Bob Joe Jeans. <laughs> <laughs> He wanted me to do that, and he said, if you don't do that, I'll hurt you tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Did you know, John, in the early years, uh, like I did when... We both uh, mm. uh, hit the sauce a little bit. No, no, sir. Oh, yes, we got in all kinds of trouble. Really? He is he, absolutely... He still gets in trouble. He was, Does he? He was wandering around the lot yesterday in a Union cavalry officer's outfit. <laughs> and you see people wandering around going, there's studio executives going, you know what? Good God, what's that? <laughs> Going, you men, stay over there. Keep wearing the Gucci suits. We'll put you in the front line. <laughs> going, <"Whoa." laughs> oh, he's wonderful, though. He's just, yeah. he's truly the spirit of joy. Yeah, he is. In fact, they clipped his wings, though. It was like, like, no, don't let him fly too high. But he's, he like, he yeah. plays. He goes off. He's a great talent. You just have to stand and go, where is he going now? <laughs> you finished this movie already. Yeah. The, uh, how'd it go? Well, it was wonderful. I had a great time. I was working with great actors, Mary Beth Hurt and people like that. Yeah. And I get very serious now. People are going, he's not being funny. No. Yeah, is, that a, is that a problem they expect you to be on no. constantly? Yeah, some, well, sometimes they expect it. It was wonderful. I called home the other day. Hi, Mom. Mark, is that you? <laughs> Mom, put Dad on. <laughs> Mark, son. Dad? <laughs> put Scruffy on. <laughs> Mark! Mark! No. <laughs> I don't know. Some... That's asking too much. Yeah. yeah. But it was funny. It was great to, he was the one that George Ray Hill was a director, and he's incredible, because he's very, the first day I tried to improvise, I was, it was a basic, it was a very simple scene, I was like, yes, I would like to do that, and then, you know, went off beyond the line, I went, yes, I would like to do that, but first we, cut, that's a wrap, get him out of here. <laughs> and he makes his face, and he'd be behind the camera, if he didn't like a scene, he'd go, <sighs> it's very hard when you're having a love scene, going, turn your eye, and you see the, <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> But it was a good experience. It you really and uh, Bill Richard Pryor have been working at the, where, the improv? The comedy store. The comedy store. Yeah. The boarding house in San Francisco, plugging all the clubs now and saying, I'll be back, don't worry now. You're a funny guy. Thank you, really you sir. Yeah. Thank you. Great to have you, you here. You too, thank you. Yeah, Mark, got that. Do I like one of your suits now? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get a suit. You get a suit. Please, send me one. Look at this. This is... <laughs> I feel like a little kitty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, it's coming unraveled, though, right? <laughs> my wife and I, we like to macrame a Volkswagen one day. <laughs> 
Uh, this is so much fun. I, I'm not scared anymore. Don't well, Why should you be? Why? Well, you're right. This is this is fun. <laughs> My career is over, but I'm not scared. <laughs> I can see it tomorrow in the National Enquirer. He's gone. We knew he'd do it. <laughs> I don't know National Enquirer though. You and I both love that magazine. Uh -huh. Aha. Right. Yeah. Well. You know, the strange thing is though, I put it in the cat box, and the cat won't go in there. <laughs> His little eyes go wide. That'd be redundant. <laughs> you got it. Right.